joined here by Derek Maben and Derek, appreciate you joining us today. Yeah, thanks for having me. Yeah, how's everything been going? You know, we're talking about your, you know, getting some games in so far this spring, off to a three and three start. How would you kind of assess the way the team's been playing so far this year? I think we're playing great. I mean, we had a couple of challenges of a couple of guys being out because of COVID, but I think we're starting to find our groove. You're off to a really good start. What's kind of been the key to your success at the plate so far? Probably trying to be reliable and trying to support my team as much as I can. So I just want to do as much as I can for my team. How exciting has it been? You know, like we said going through last year, you know, you guys having to wait to play, you know, getting our, you know, some games in last year, you get it stopped. Just kind of walk us through what it was like last year, you know, having your season stopped early to then getting back to this year now, getting back into it. Well, we only played about like three series last year, so it was kind of tough to have it taken away, but this year I think we're more than ready to start playing again and start getting some wins. What were some of the things you focused on last year, you know, when you weren't able to play your season, you know, and you're basically going online online learning, you know, doing remote, you know, the workouts and everything else and trying to keep up with your teammates. What were kind of the focus for you to, you know, keep things going during that time? Probably trying to stay busy and trying to stay active because, you know, COVID tried to keep us all inside. So trying to, you know, get the fundamentals down for baseball and like practice, getting in the cage and, uh, you know, just getting in shape for next season. How much does it help having you know, your brother there too, you know, Jacob, because, you know, he was going through the same situation as well. How much did, you know, how help having him there as a, you know, person you could work out with and be able to talk to about it? Oh, yeah, that's big help because, you know, we help each other on a lot of things and we critique each other and we uh, support each other. And, you know, he's a throwing partner. So, yeah, we just did a lot in the cage and, you know, it's been great having him. You know, like I talked to about him and talked to you before about it. I mean, how nice is it to have, you know, your brother here? You guys are always out there finishing each other's sentences. I hear you guys out there talking all the yeah. time, finishing each other's yeah. sentences. You guys know where the other one's going to go. I mean, how cool is it to, to have your brother here with you, you know, every day when you're going through college and playing together with him? Well, it's, it's cool. I mean, you don't really see the opportunity for that happening that much. So it's awesome. I mean, uh, we've always played together and, you know, getting that, opportunity to play in college that was I was very proud of that and yeah we've just been very competitive against each other sometimes annoying but yeah and was that always the goal too as you know said getting a chance to go to college together and getting to play you know you guys both being from Newburgh was that kind of the you know hey we want to play at the college you know collegiate level if we could and then what was kind of the draw to Western Oregon for you guys it wasn't really the goal but we were just trying to get into college. That was like the number one goal there, but it just happened, you know, Western took an interest in us and it was one of the only schools that took an interest. So love, I love that and um, I love our time here. You, know, you think back to your first year, I mean, it was a, a great first year, you know, with this team, you know, you had all the guys that, you know, five guys getting drafted, you know, and to go play in the pros, you know, what was it like playing on that team as, you know, your first year out there and getting to experience that here at Western? It was great. I mean, everyone was dedicated. Everyone was bought in into the team and exactly it exemplified what a team should look like at the college level. And, you know, Jacob and I just bought into that and turned out well. So, you know, we've seen you at that shortstop making those plays and is it always kind of been your spot for you to play short? And I mean, what, what do you like most about playing that position? I probably like uh, getting dirty. So, I like diving, showing the range off, but yeah, I'd have to say, you know, uh, it's a it's an important position. I like it because, you know, it just, it speeds things up and those double plays are, are good too, so. What was it about the sport of baseball growing up in particular that kind of got you into it and what, you know, what else do you enjoy the most about? I know you kind of touched on it, but what's kind of, you know, been the main draw for you for baseball over the years? Probably the start would have to be my brother and I would, since we're so competitive, we had to find one particular sport for that we could you know show our anger off on each other growing up it was just me and him who could hit better and stuff but yeah it's been good growing up and we favored baseball and last thing for you here Derek too you know now that we're you know just a handful of games in the season what are you looking forward to the most this year and you know seeing out of this season I'm looking forward to playing more with my teammates you know I love this team it's definitely different so uh, just looking forward to playing with them and building with them. So, yeah, just looking to get some wins. All right, Derek. Well, we really appreciate you swinging by and catching up with us today. Best of luck this season, and we'll talk to you here soon. Yeah, thank you. Thanks for having me.